Well, it's day two. We had a very eventful day one. Um, a lot of drama, unfortunately. You saw it took us a while to get that X3 out. Um, real bummer deal. Him and his buddy had to go get the trailer and they were out of the ride. And um, everyone got, got through to the beach. It was all good. We all kind of met back up and then unfortunately some more people had some issues. But uh, overall, really fun trip for some reason. This trail, you guys saw some of the video I posted. I mean, it's, it's soft and sandy and all of our cars are loaded down. And this ride compared to any other ride I've done, it just really hammers cars. So um, it's soft and you think it's forgiving. So you want to hit those loops harder and you saw how I was going through it. You know, a couple of paces I'd wait and then kind of go pretty fast just to get some better footage. Um, but I don't really feel comfortable going a whole lot faster than that with the car all loaded down. And ironically, when you get to the beach here, it's like 80 degrees with a breeze. But a lot of our cars, my cars running at 207 degrees. Uh, a couple other turbos are running 215, 220-ish uh, and, and a lot of belt slippage and, and belts going. So it's just this like really heavy sand and, and when your car is all loaded down, uh, burns a lot of gas on this ride. I brought six gallons of fuel and um, put it all in. And then I think by the time I got here to El Golf, I had like one or two bars left. So definitely a fuel sucking ride, especially if you've got a turbo um, X3 or, or a Razor or whatnot. So all in all, we're still here. I had a good night. Uh, we're all a little bit zapped because the groups never made it to El Golfo this late. So um, usually we're here, we stay a full day in El Golfo. We go up to the lighthouse and hang out, but um, we just kind of hung out, laid low. Our local restaurant that we always go to, the Dolphin, El Dolphin was closed. So we ate, found some tacos and uh, showered up and, and hung out and had some beers and stuff and uh, getting ready for today. So hopefully um, people drive a little bit slower or if they do or don't, just uh, less issues. Another guy lost a rear axle. Um, luckily for us, good, uh, cars running great. So. All loaded up, got our ice, got our snacks, and then now we're gonna get back. So hopefully we can get back and make good time and then um, get to the Survivor's Internet wrecked in the reef. So we'll catch up with you guys in a bit.
skeleton's still hanging tough. <laughs> Hasn't even moved an inch. <laughs> Okay, who's ready for our first few hot dogs? I know if you can't find it, I've got mine pretty handy. and power steering i'm just gonna head over to the road right there can you get up there? uh we should be almost to that house to the house yeah okay. we should be real okay. close to that house so okay i didn't see it on but you still got steering yeah right. steering's fine Well, we made it back. Two long days. Uh, car worked awesome. Had a really fun trip. I think that trail is getting pretty, pretty racy. I'd say pretty whooped out, pretty chattery. Definitely the roughest I've ever seen it. And uh, man, Turbo S never let me down again. Had no issues at all. Had a really fun time. Had good weather. A um, couple more cars having a few more issues, but it's all part of the trail. This ride's got a little bit of everything. You got the the beach going, which is cool and beautiful and chill, no dust. But then it's really hard on the cars. Um, the whoops, like I said, you saw some of that footage, uh, especially when you're trying to pick up the pace. 
it's hard on the car, especially when you're all loaded down. So excited to be back. I think the wife had a really good time. Uh, we're gonna get cleaned up, head to the survivor's dinner, um, celebrate everyone having a good time and being safe and uh, have some beers one last night before we have to uh, head out in the morning and back to reality. You know, people bring down, you know, the, we, we, we got money for, for it. Let's just show it up. The money we, we raise, the volunteer work that we do, awesome. bring it down the dog food and stuff like that. We, we raised $1,500 nice. on this trip because of all you guys. All right. All right, Mark. All right. All right. We got that guy. I am that guy. And it's wrong. Whoever gets it. And don't leave it here when you go. Yeah, don't leave it here. Dog has a scar for life, so it's a dog! Oh. Oh.